today we're going to start a new series and we're going to focus on video editing. So we're going to use a program that's called Caden Live. To do that, we need to first download and install it. So let's just go straight onto our computers and I'll show you how to do that on Windows. Okay, so here I am on the cadenlive.org website. You can find the link at the bottom of this video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to install it for Windows. So I'm going to click on this middle one and it's going to pop up with a little window that says Caden Live, the version number, .exe, and I'm just going to click Save File. It's going to start my download up at the top here, and I've already downloaded it before, so I'm going to go, and now that it's already on my computer, I can click on this Caden Live .exe. This is not the actual program. This is just an unpackaging program, and for this, I now have to say yes to allow it to do some changes to my computer. And then it's gonna do its thing, hopefully. There we go. Um, and then I can just go and install for anyone using this computer. If this is your side of a computer that you're using, you can install it just for you if you want. I'm just gonna install it for everyone. And it's gonna tell me, it's gonna do all the installation for me. It's gonna put it in the right place. It's gonna make it so that I can find it in my start menu. And you should be all ready to go once it's done installing. Perfect, and when it's done, you just have to click finish. And now if I go down to my little Windows icon and type in Kden Live, it should be able to find it and I should be able to just click on it and start it. The first time it opens, it might take a little while to open. Just give it some time. It's just trying to sort itself out the first time. And there we go. We have Kden Live installed and ready to go. Now, for the other computer systems, if you have a Linux, you just have to download this first file, it's called an app image, and then you just have to make that file runnable, put it somewhere on your computer where your other applications are, and it just runs straight from that file. You don't need to install, okay? If you're doing Mac, you're gonna have to follow those compiling and installing information documentation that's down here uh, under Mac OS X. Sorry, that's not an easier thing to follow, um, but you should be able to get it to run on Mac. All right, guys, so that's it. Caden Live is pretty cool because it's free software, so downloading it is super simple. You don't have to pay for it. So we're going to get into this series a little bit more in the next few episodes, and I'm going to show you what we're going to be building. And in the next episode, I'm just going to show you the different parts of Caden Live and how we're going to start using it. So thanks, guys. Make sure you subscribe below so you don't miss out on any of that. And we'll see you later. Bye. Mm -hmm.